So we're here again with Paul. Paul, why is it important to have interactivity in your prototypes? So it's important to have interactivity in your prototypes because one thing that I often see in demos or in presentations uh, is that I want to say, hey, here's my prototype. And unfortunately, this doesn't give you a really good understanding of how somebody's actually going to use your prototype. I'm not the user. You are not your user. right? And so if I use this prototype, mm -hmm. I am an expert in it. I can I know how to get good results. Right. If I do this, mm -hmm. the yeah, person like this. and you right and, and you can actually use it and play with it and interact with it. Mm -hmm. You have never seen this before. Right. So you're going to be a much better uh, representation of how an end user is actually going to use this. Right. Right. The other thing, uh, if there's really nobody else around, what you can do is get really drunk mm -hmm. and then use your prototype, and that's going to be actually a fairly good approximation about. The, uh, some random person on the internet right. using your device or using your, your website. Mm -hmm. um, there are actually a few different services that you can go online and find where you will have a usability expert mm -hmm. get drunk and review your usability and send you a report on it. Awesome. Thank you, Paul. You're welcome.